What is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. Now in this Movavi tutorial, I'm going to show you guys exactly how to teleport because you guys really seem to enjoy these videos in Vegas Pro 18. So it's the perfect opportunity to show you guys how to do that in Movavi. So this is basically what we'll be recreating today. So that's a really, really cool teleport effect guys. I'm going to show you guys, of course, right after the intro. All right, guys. So as you can see right now, we are in Movavi Video Editor Plus 2021. So this is the intro part that you guys have seen. So how you actually want to first shoot it is you want to go and place it like this. So how you want to shoot this one is very, very simple. So you want to basically do all of the text and then you want to look into the lens for a couple more seconds. So this is how I originally shot it. So as you notice right there, I just look, I don't immediately cut to black or have anything happen. I just look into the lens for just a little bit, so like this. So that's where you want to actually go and cut to the next scene. So the next scene that we need is, of course, a clip where we have our chair. So for a little bit of detail, I actually just twisted it in my chair just a little bit, as you notice with the movement right there, if I play it back. Right here, of course, I'm still looking into the screen, so I'm going to hold my left mouse on here so I can actually trim this down until it is completely the shot of the chair, which is right here. So that looks really, really nice. So let's time these both up. Basically, what will be today? All right, that looks really, really nice. So I'm gonna also make this one where I'm gonna look into the lens a little bit shorter. So let's play it back right now. Basically, what will be today? All right, so now we have actually disappeared from the screen, but to actually cover this up, we need a really, really nice effect. So for this one, I'm going to use this free overlay stock footage, this lens flare animation. So I'm going to actually time it up as well on the timeline. Today. Right, so right here when it cuts to black, I'm going to also cut it off. So I'm going to press Control B. So now that we have split it, we can remove the last part. Now, as you notice right here, we cannot see through the clip. And we, of course, we need to make it see through. So we're going to click on this chroma key icon right here. So now what you want to do is you want to click on this pencil icon to select a color. So right here, we're going to pick the black one right here in the background. You need to mess a little bit more with these markers until everything looks accurately. So that's what I'm going to do right now until it's completely changed transparent and the black background is removed and then you want to click on apply all right guys so now it's completely transparent as you can see it's nice and see-through if i play this back right here so now we need to only match this one up so let's go and play it back right now and place these ones against each other like this all right so that happens way too late so i'm going to drag this guy to the left now as you notice i can completely freely move this around in my timeline but if it's jumping back on your timeline you want to click on this icon which basically allows you to go and move it freely so let's time it up right now All right, that looks really cool. But of course, the transition underneath it is a little harsh. So we're going to actually make a really, really nice transition. So then we're going to go to the third icon, which is the transitions. And then you can, of course, choose to make a fade, a blur, a circle. So I'm going to make a really, really quick crossfade. So we're going to drag this crossfade in between these clips right here. And then you can actually choose like how fast do you want it to have it. So if you want to drag this one slower and smaller, the faster it's going to be. The longer this line is going to be, then the longer the transition is going to be as well. Well, that's obvious. So now let's play it back without the actual effect, just with the crossfade. So that looks really nice. So now let's time it up with a lens flare. Well, it comes in a little bit too early. So let's play it back. And I think the transition is also a little bit too slow. All right, so I think it looks pretty nice, but I'm going to actually drag it just a little bit backwards. So let's see what that looks like. 
Alright guys, so that looks really, really nice. It's quite a basic one, but of course, if you want to teleport to somewhere else, you can actually change up the, you know, the transitions type and the overlay. You can have something over the entire screen as well. If you want that, or if you just want to keep it basic and simple, you can just use this really nice lens flare overlay. And that's how to teleport in the Movavi Video Editor Plus 2021. Alright guys, so that's it for this video. Now you guys know how to properly teleport yourself in Movavi to a different place or just out of the screen. So that's all I have for you guys today. If you want to pick up Movavi video editing software, make sure to check out the link down in the description. Thanks a lot for your continued support and I'll see you guys obviously in the next video.